Bottom of Tet Zion on the base. We're going to be doing Yud Zion tonight. He's he's learning the blot we learned yesterday. Because now he's teaching when Saturday night or Sunday morning, Yonatan. Yes, Sunday morning. Should have been. Oh, I know what happened. He went to Toronto, and the guy who was uh, substitute didn't report it. And we're not going to. Also saw that a quantum issue of things and stuff. Okay, anyway, I'm not sure if that all. So we're in case of sex thing, in the case of Suffolk Cole. So they might know what's going to be Okay. Um, we're in Porto, Portugal. And we are going to be doing Dafyud Zion. 17 Ksubas. We're going to be starting on the bottom of Ted Zainamud Bay's famous, famous, famous uh, Bryce. Tonor Abonon. Kate says, Maragdin Lifneak Kala. What do you say uh, when you dance in front of the Kala? What, 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 what's the Nusa? Rashi says, Ma Oymin Lifneak. What do you say in front of him? Shame Oymin Kala Kamoishihi. Rashi. Lifi Oyfi of a Hashivusa Makas Nusa. If she's pretty, you say she's pretty. If she's not, you, you describe her exactly as she is. Well, she's not, she, not pretty. You talk about the order of so good. You were. talk about how the, 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 maybe the family is good. No. Rashi says, She's got chain. Chain is coming off of her. And you say it on everybody, no matter what. So Beishamai says to Beishamai, if she's lame or blind, it's Shakir. The Torah says you have to stay away from Shakir. Your friend comes home from the market and says, look, I bought this wonderful thing and you know that it's terrible. But you praise it. You may want to make him feel good. Even though you know he made a mistake or whatever, he prays it. So here also we have to praise the chos. In his eyes, she's really You have to. Each person has his own das, and you have to respect it. And love is a fickle thing. For some people, you know, it's, it, it, you can't you can't predict who's going to fall in love with who. This is the way they used to sing in front of the Kalsner's Israel. Lo kachal, kachal is like makeup that they put around their eyes. Velo srak, seva hamadim rouge, to make them, you know, makeup, rouge. Velo pirchus, Rashi says, klia seyar, braiding their hair. But even one Rashi says, doesn't make a difference. She's a she's a even without all the pitch of kiss. When they gave Smichat Rab Zeira, they said this, they sang the same song. He he is Yalas no matter what, uh, regarding regarding his uh, wisdom. When the Chachamim gave smicha, Rabbi Ravasi, Sherlo Hachi, Kol Mindain, the Kol Mindain Smocholana. A lot of people, some like this, some like this. Lo Tismocholana, Lo Minsarm Susi, Lo Minsarm Susi. Means we want to give smicha to people like this, not to Shmatis, and not to uh, Rashi says Oimim Chanusi. Someone who. He doesn't say over Torah with a nice tongue, only a fifth of what he should say. Or Tormus and Lois Parishi. Parishi says it's not explainable, um, but he gives another shot. The Mikri of Lus, it's like turnips. And so these are empty people, empty people. We don't want to give smichel to that. 
Another prat, see, with the concept of, of, of getting one fifth of the chachma from the word chamis. When Ravavo would travel from the yeshiva to the house of the Roman Caesar, as I'll say in many places in Shasta, Ravavo was close to this to the Roman royalty. So the various uh, servants of the Caesar, I guess they knew him because he would appear here frequently. They would sing, Rabba da Ami, the Rav of the great nation, who is Barna de Umsi, and the one who is the leader, is a Mani for the nation. Mutsina Dunar, he lights like a candle. Brich Mosech Lashovin, like Borchaba, Amalav Ravida Ben Eloi, Shainotel Bachel Adas Rakhid Makal. You know, would take a, a myrtle branch and dance in front of the kala with, with the uh, the oimer kala nova chasuda because you can see the, the the hadas and the chasuda. I think maybe is a play on words there. It was a close close mm-hmm. close connection in words, and and a myrtle is a beautiful fragrance and probably reflects fertility. Rav Shmuel, Rav Yitzchak, Merakid, Atlas. Rav Shmuel would take three branches and dance. <clears throat> He's mezalzel, the covet of the Torah. The Rabbonim were not happy when he danced with these three Adas. But Om Rav Zeyra, when Rav Shmuel, Rav Yitzchak passed away, that um, there used to be from people's graves fire coming out of and the, the the pillar of fire that came out of his grave separated from the rest of the Israel to show that he was he was really an Adam Godel. That means what he did, dancing with the three Hadassim was was a great thing. Gmiri, there's a Mesoira in the in our hands. This event would not take place only once in a generation or twice in a generation. This shtus um, that this old man used to do, it was it was moiling him. It helped him with this mitzvah that he was medagdek. He got he got a lot of schar. But Amila she tosila abba. I mean, it's not the shtus, but the, his is <clears throat> oh the fact that he acted like a shaita, like a clown, uh, and some say no, it was a shita. The first shot is that it was a shtus. The second shot it was a shita. That was his minic to do it, not, and they don't call it a shtus. Ravacha Markiv Le'akatfim Rakiv, famous, famous story. Ravacha would carry the would 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 carry the kala on his shoulders, like when we lift the chos and kala on yeah. chairs. He didn't Here's bother the with the chair. Okay. He just he lifted the kala. I'm really Rabbonan. I'm not Mala Mevrach. What about Sneas? What's going on here? How could you do this? Listen, if, if you can view the Kala like a piece of wood, like a wooden beam, then fine, you can do like me, the low, low. But if not, not. So he was able to uh, take all of those thoughts that we might have in our heads and get rid of them. And and he, he treated him. He treated her just like a wooden beam. There's a halach. You don't look to look at an Asia siege. You don't like to stare at an Asia siege. However, Rabbi Shmuel Ben Achmei said, "It comes to a kala because you want to make the chosen feel good. That everyone is looking at the beauty of the kala makes the kala makes the chosen feel good." So he said it was mutter. To make the, the husband love her more. However, it says, um, So it's not the halach. You have a funeral going on, when you have a caravan that's escorting a kala. The Levi waits and the Kala goes first. My Venus, I made with that. The Zevazem was a Melech Israel. Now, now Israel's coming through, both have to stop. 
the Levaya and the Kala, there's a precedence the Mace Coast, the Melech Coast. Omra Laval Agrippus, the Melech Shah Overland had Kala, but Agrippus gave cover to the Kala. He stopped and let the Kala go first. The Sheep Hu Chachon. And the Chachobim praised Agrippus and Melech. Agrippus was after Herod Hurtus. Right? Hurtus is like zero CE. Agrippus is like 14, 20 CE, something like that. And there are a number of stories of Agrippus, some good, some bad. In in Shas now, Freyt Gemara Shibchu Mechlad the Shaper of that. What do you mean? There's a concept that everybody could be Mechlad's covet except for except for a Melech, Shola Melech, who was Mechlad is covet. That's why he, one of the reasons why he was his downfall. The Melech cannot be Mavater his covet, right? Vam Rav Asher Filu Man Doamar Nasi Shemoch Lakvod Kodem Moch. And Nasi was like Rav Yudah Nasi. He was a, there was it would eventually during the period of Aishani, uh, there was no Machos anymore, but the Sanhedrin had an Avbezdin and a Nasi. The Nasi came from the house from Beis David since the time of Hillel. And, and all the children of Hillel, Viter, Rabbi Nasi. Some people calculate their Yichos from here to Rabbi Nasi because they, the Mashiach comes from there. So even those that say that a Nasi can be Machol is covered, quote, and quote a Machol, Melech Shemachol, quote, and quote a Machol. A melech cannot do it. The parsha in Dvorim that speaks about the commandment to appoint a king. And the drosha is, his fear has to be on you. And he cannot be mevater on his covet. More answers, parsha is drochim avi. He didn't mamish. There was a fork in the road. It wasn't nicker to other people. He went one way and the color went the other way. So it wasn't clearly nicker that he was being moichel on his covet. That's why he was allowed to do it. That's why the Chachamim praised him there. You're in yeshiva. You're learning. Can you vatel Torah to go to a funeral, to go to a wedding? The answer is yes. And then they give us a maisa. Which, you know, you tell me Allah, they give me a maisa. That strengthens it. Sometimes we have a maisa after Allah. It, 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 the post game, they, they spell Paskin strongly because of the mice as well. If there's, a, when do, can you move about the Torah? If there's not enough in the Levaya for the covet of the, of the mace, but we'll see what that means <laughs> very soon. If there's enough people for the Levaya, and then he can stay and learn. Chemical circle. Mm-hmm. So what's the what's the criteria? Tracer Alfe Gavri, twelve thousand people, men, but she saw fish and six thousand people blowing shoifu. Meaning you could be Mavatl well, Kamator yeah. for most kids. Now we've had recent funerals, right? Well your shiv order they said a million people were there. Okay, so we'll see why. Yes, that's what I'm saying. They say, for you most people, go. you can go. Army law, some say it's slaves for Alfei Gavri, 12,000 people. Umina Yushita, from those 12,000, there were 6,000 Shoifer blows. Ula Omar, Kigon the Chaitzi Gavri Me Avula Vatsichra. No, no. The Avula is the gate of the city until the Vatsichra is the place of the Kever. That there has to be enough people standing between that place and that place, so it's probably even a larger crowd. And Rav Sheish says, "Vitem Rav Yochanan Mar Netilaso Kinesinoso." No, when a Talmud Chacham dies, so we're referring now not to Stam a, per, a Jew. We're, we're talking about Talmud Chacham. Talmud Chacham dies; it's like the Torah dies, and therefore the removal of a Talmud Chacham is like when the Torah was given. Ma Nesinoso. Shishim Rubo, that the Torah was given 600,000 men after Tilosa Rubo. So you have to have 600,000 people by the by the Leviah of, a, of an autumn. Hanim in Laman de Korvitoni. Now, who gets that kind of funeral? A Ben Toy, who, who can read Psukim and can learn Mishnayas as well. Of Laman de Masni. Someone who teaches others is Lacherim, says Rashi. Avalman de Masni, less lay shiura. There's no shear. It's even more than 600,000. So Rashi says, Umimele Shamin and Tilman de Loikori, Veloitani. 
a regular Yisrael. He doesn't he read, doesn't read Psukim, doesn't read Mishnayas. Ain Mavatlin in Yeshlo Misaskim Kidek Fura Baalm. So you, you don't you don't know about the Tzavat Torah if there's enough people to bury the person. That's how that's how that's so. Kamakol Tzor. Let's see what the Rabbim Shulchanor says here. Kamakol Tzor Chashul Meis. Im Talmud Chacham Ushakar Vishon Alatzmo. If he's somebody who learned for himself, didn't teach. Shir I'm alive. Maso who Shishim Ribo. Six hundred thousand. Umishul Ekar Veloishana. Somebody didn't read Pesukim and didn't learn Mishnah. If you have 10, it's considered. Regular person is considered like he, he read Psukim and learned. Somebody who taught Torah Rabbim ain't sheer cloud. That called Chayovim Bahaviyosa. Venira. She was Manazek. Slim Chotivrek Mora. The Moid Cotton, because there's another sugi Moid Cotton that we learned. Shudav Kasher Lohayu Beir Chavura Shoynos. That's if there wasn't a Chavra Kadisha. Avo Kasher Hayu Chavura Shoynos. If there's a Chavra that is tasked in every city to deal with the maze, Kol Chavura Misasekas B'Mei Shalom. Then the Chavra deals with it, and and sounds like if you're learning, you don't have to go and Mavati. Kol Mokom Kishru Alavaya Tzach Lavas Kesas Zemes. But let's say it passes by where he is, you have to take some steps with it, period. The Mishnah said, we're talking about the case where the where um, man and woman come to Beston. They lost the Ksuba. They don't have the Ksuba. And she claims I was a Ksuba and I want Messiah. And he claims there was no, she was not a Ksuba. I want to, only want to give her a hundred. So we said if there were 80 and that saw her being taken out in a Hinuma, we didn't know what that was. We had some opinions. They only used the Hinuma when it was a Psuba. So if there were Adim that said there was a Hinuma, she gets 200. My Hinuma, what's this Hinuma? Surch of Bar Papa. By the way, Mark was talking about the Bar Papas. Here's one of the sons of Bar Papa. Very unusual that we see. I don't think there's another place in Shazam. Yeah, uh, yeah, 10 sons of Bar Papa. So, so, we, had, so, uh, so, we had one last week or two. The question is, that are all 10 mentioned? And after that's a good question. But anyways, Surah of Bapapa, Mishmeh de Ziri Omar, Tanura de Asa. It was a round chupa made of hadassim. And that was made, and they put it on her head like a garland, nice. like a wreath. They would put, they would cover the face of the kala with a cloth so thick that she'd be able to fall asleep because nobody could see her face. And that's why you go to some of these. That, that's what very well says. Is a shot in it's related to another word. Rashi says, <laughs> a round wreath that was placed on her head. Rashi says like they did in worms or, or tra, tra in France. She falls asleep there. Her eyes are not seen. You say the bracha, let the sleep be taken from the from my eyes. So that's the word hinuma from the word tenuma. So that proves that, proves that she was absurd. So if there were eight in that she was taken by Hinuma, then she gets to her. Mona Masai. Ton. Hi, Mario. Good to Hello. see you. Good to see you. Hi, Ellen. Hi, Mario. Behuda right. So What was the proof in Yehuda and Bebav Elmai? And what was the, we're talking about for Psuba. We see different, loca different locations had different simonim, which would declare that she was a Psuba. Amarav, Darduge de Mishcha Aresha de Rabbonon. They would sprinkle olive oil on the heads of the Rabbonon when they would bury off of the Psuba. Amarav Rav Papa Labai. Mishcha de Chafifusa Ka'om Amar. 
didn't understand what this minute was all about. Amale, Yasma, like you Yos, you were Yosim. What did did you're not your mother? Uh, you don't know these things. You're not a bucket in the hog game. Uh, uh, did your mother not have sprinkled on the heads of the chachamim at the time of her wedding? Of course she did. There was a, a rav that was dealing with the, the wedding of his son, Rav Barula, but the Amila Sampa will say. It was Rabbi Bar Ula Yosik Le Lebrei Behum who was dealing with the wedding of his son in this other Rabbanan's house. The Dardig Mishcha Rashad Rabbanan Bishaz Maisa. And he sprinkled uh, his shemen on the heads of the Rabbanan during the, during the wedding. Now, and this is in Yehuda or Baba? This was both in Yehuda and in Baba. Amal Tamai, what did they do for an Almana? I mean, somebody who's not a basula, right? or like a grusha got married, or an almona got married, right? Tanya Rav Yosef, Armata Lesley Kisna. So we said in yesterday's Mishnah that they would hand out parched wheat kernels when they corn made nuts. a wedding of a basula, like corn nuts. And by an almona, they did not hand those out. So the absence of something was the simon. Not the, not the, pre, that wasn't a positive simon, it was the absence of something. Then, then the Mishnah had a, had a Rabbi Yeshua who we had these cases in the in the previous parak and in, and in this parak as well, where the Kala would come with certain claims. She was found to be, for example, after the wedding night, not a Basura. And then she would claim, I was raped after Kiddushin. And nistachva sade, like you're, as if your field was washed out. You lot, it's not my fault. I was, I can go back to live with you. Um, and 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 so, so she claims at least a hundred. He wants to say, no, no, it's a mekach tos. You were you were not a basula before I married you. I expect you to be a basula, and and I don't, it's a low clue. So it's, the debate is between mana a hundred versus a local. She admits that she's a, she's not a basula. Question is, how did she become a not a basula? If it happened after Kiddushin, he can't claim Mekach If he can, if he wants not to pay her anything, he can say, no, no, you, you had already not been a Basula before you got there. So, so there, there's not a Migu. Yeah, so there's a Migu there that Rabbi Gamliel believes her. Rabbi Shua does not believe. What's the Migu? She's going to lie and tell a better lie. She's going to say, I was a Mukasait. I fell off a bike. Because it's not, it's not nice to say I was raped by another man. So if she's going to lie, I would just tell a better lie. That's fair. That we learned over there that meaning. And Rabbi Gamliel believes that Rabbi Yeshua did not believe. However, in our Mishnah, we said, Moida Rabbi Yeshua, there Rabbi Yeshua was arguing in everything. The Mishnah talked about a case. He said, I bought a field from you, but you know what? This field was your father's. It, it belonged to your father, but I bought it from him. That means I have the field. And the other guy's claiming it's not your field. So I say to him, no. It was your father's, but I bought it from him. So there also, it's a bad migu. It's a migu. If you're going to lie, why, why mention that it was his? That, that ruins his, his chazaka, that it's his. So, but Rabbi Yeshua, so but even Rabbi Yeshua, because of this migu, that if he's going to lie, tell a better lie, he believes it. And Mishum de Kabbalah Mr. Seif. Now, what if there are Adim that. There, it, 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 the, the, the field is his. And, he, and, he, and the guy says, no, I bought it from your father. Then Because we don't need, it's not from his mouth that we're getting that information. Now, what's the exact place? If the guy ate, if you eat for three years in a field and the guy doesn't protest, it squatters rights. The, the, the land becomes yours. So eat the he ate the, the requisite number of years. So Amilo Mahamin. With the Khazaka that he ate in the in the field without being chased away, you should be believed. Now if he eat the if he if we saw that there was no that he ate the number of years in the field, of course we don't believe him. So Iochi Gabi Aviv Nami. So what the case about the father, that means he could have also just challenged the guy. I bought it from you. Not why do you have to bring the father in? 
So the same thing. If he ate for the three years in the field, why should he believe? So what about just looking at whether he ate in the field and he wasn't chased away? So Bishop Gabi Aviv Mishkacha. So by the case where I claimed it, I took it from the father, Kigo. He ate for two years while the father was alive, and the father died. And then he ate one year. The father wasn't there, but the Beno was there. It means if the if the, if the Beno was a cotton, eating in the field and not having him protest is not good enough because he doesn't know enough. Uh, uh, he doesn't know what his what the father's refush was. He doesn't know how to protest, etc. So it's not considered a proper chazal. Was he definitely know the guy was there eating? Say again? Was he even know the no, but even if he know a cotton is not going to know the details, it's not going to be able to. So a cotton's protest is not considered a valid protest. So Ravuna must need to know I mean, what's Ravuna teaching me? We already know this mission. So Iboy said, Ravuna, the Yukadim must need some karma. He's telling us that this mission is giving us the same deal. Iboy, same if you want. I'll tell you, I feel a big deal. It means even if the child at some point grew up, it doesn't work. Kamash Malon. That, that it still doesn't work. The, the listening of the day. So why didn't the Mishnah talk about the case directly with the guy that you're buying the field from? Why do you have to bring the father in? The look at going to Stein It might be I ate two years when he wasn't around, but one year when he was around. Kigon Shabarach. And maybe the guy had gone and went to China uh, in the third year. And therefore, it's not mitzvah to the two years the chazak. Now, the one wants to baruch mach was my. I mean, he ran away. He the baruch mach was the first choice. If he was being chased for his life, the government was after him. They wanted to kill him. So pshita the lomehemen. So certainly, he's not going to be believed. The lomotzi machi, because he's not capable of protesting. The balas sode. He's hiding himself. So he's, he's not going to be able to come out and protest. So, so that is not going to be a good to, 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 to fight against that claim. And let somebody who's running after him for money. So he bought he should have protested. That he doesn't have to physically be there. He can protest from afar. Where do we see that? This none. Shalosh Aratzos Lachazaka. But then Eretz was divided into three lands: Huda, Ever Yarden, Vehagolu. Hayib Yehuda Vehachzik Vehagolim. Let's say what the person is Yehuda, and the guy's trying to squat in a person's field in Golim. Vice versa, Vehagol Vehachzik Yehuda. It's Ein Chazaka. Ad she Imo B'Medina. They have to be in the same country for the protest to be valid, because otherwise he may not know. The guy will claim, no, the reason I didn't protest was well, I wasn't here. I didn't know you were here. Now, Vinamba, Mike, so what really was this for in this machlokes? Iksar machash shloy b'fun of is protest when you're not there. Consider macha. So I feel a bit of a golden nami. What do you mean? I could be in, in the same Yehuda, but I'm not in front of them. I might be 10 miles away. I'm still in Yehuda. Iksar machash b'fun of lavi macha. And if being protesting when you're not there is not considered macha. So I feel you to be So even if you were in Yehuda, if it's not considered a protest, like I could be a block away and it's still not a good macha. So on Really we ask that you can protesting by not physically being there is still considered macha. But Masnison, which didn't accept it, Bishas Khirum Shiny. It was a Shasashmad, right? The Roman government, the, the roads were not Secure, and you couldn't go very, and therefore information didn't go very clearly from you to look at So, if the balasod is somewhere else, and there's no connection there, but there's no chazaka. Now today, with modern communication, you know, the, the, the laws, of course, would be different. Shulchan Aruch, the Rambam says, Machom Vatelas is a chazaka. That if somebody's squatting in your field, and you protest, it gets rid of the chazaka. And he doesn't have to be in front of the guy. He could, he could be hearing about it somewhere else. And he said, I protest that guy there. 
If there were caravans traveling between the two places and there's communication routes, then he could, then the machol would work. Okay. Uh, I'll let you know tomorrow when we're going to do it, okay?